David Muir, co-host of 20 Over 20, said he wants no part of Amy Robach's scandal with T.J. Holmes. He is not accepting it. Since the ABC News story became public, people have been curious as to David Muir's reaction to Amy Robach and T.J. Holmes' affair and how the other co-anchors have handled the situation. Among the many presenters on ABC News are Muir, Robach, and Holmes. Specifically, Robach and Holmes co-anchor GMA3, What You Need to Know, a late morning edition of Good Morning America, with Jennifer Ashton. Along with Muir, she also co-hosts 20 Over 20. After Page Six claimed that the two had split from their marriages, Andrew Shu and Marilee Feebig, in August 2022 following a months-long affair, word of Robach and Holmes' connection first surfaced in November 2022. They appear to have a very close friendship, but that is to be anticipated. However, they took great care behind the scenes to conceal their relationship. The news that they are having an affair has startled the GMA producers, a source previously informed the website. What did David Muir say about the relationship between Amy Robach and TJ Holmes? On December 12, 2022, a source told Page Six that Robach's 20 over 20 co-host David Muir wants no role in her Holmes issue. He won't stand for it. He is the anchor for the evening news, yet he never appears in the news. No one at a BC liked the way Amy and TJ handled it since he's so private, the insider claimed. Every anchor is furious that Amy and TJ have produced such controversy, the source continued. Robach and Muir aren't close, according to Page Six, who also claimed that her affair with Holmes has only harmed their relationship. Nobody wants to be linked with this, and Amy and David aren't very close at the moment, according to the source. However, a spokesperson for a BC News refuted Page Six's allegation of Muir's response. David is focused on the work, not any of this, the spokesperson told Page Six. Several ABC News employees were extremely angry, according to sources, with a joke Robach and Holmes made on GMA3 about having a wonderful week after their affair was revealed. If it has been decided not to be addressed, then don't be addressed. On broadcast, TJ made fun of it. Although Amy is more intelligent than that, how else is she meant to respond? Stated one insider. This is a significant distraction for her because she's a serious hard news journalist. The source stated, she was really eager to join 20 over 20 as a co-anchor. She was driven to death to land that job. She is being degraded by this affair, which is also affecting her reputation. As for the other ABC News anchors, on December 1, 2022, a source claimed to The Sun that the hosts of Good Morning America, Robin Roberts and George Stephanopoulos, were furious at their co-anchor's messy affair because of the controversy it brought to the show, similar to today's scandal involving Matt Lauer, who, after 20 years on the news program, was sacked in 2017 on claims of inappropriate sexual behavior. This is not to George and Robin's liking. The insider declared, this is a mess. They took satisfaction in avoiding having a sexual controversy like today did with Matt Lauer in the past. They were very proud that all of their hosts were good, married, and dedicated people, the insider stated. The insider claimed that Roberts, who grew close to Robach when Roberts, a breast cancer survivor, persuaded Robach to have an on-air mammogram on Good Morning America in 2013, which resulted in a life-saving diagnosis, found out about Robach and Holmes' affair more challenging. The insider claimed, Amy and Robin are pretty close. On live television, Robin persuaded Amy to undergo a mammogram that might ultimately save her life. Their relationship is solid. Robin is an idealist, said the insider. She is in charge. She intervenes when anything goes awry and orders everyone to clean up the mess. I'm not sure there is a way to make this one look tidy either. For a morning show, everything here is really filthy. On December 2, 2022, a source also informed Page Six that Roberts had approached Holmes and Robach about the talk before it became public, although Robach denied it at the time. The two had been the subject of rumors of an affair as early as 2017. The insider claimed, drew them both aside and essentially said, stop it. In addition to being very devout, the insider stated, doesn't enjoy this kind of scandal tainting the show. Robach refuted the reports, but a different source told Page Six that Holmes, a more recent hire at ABC News than Robach, was so worried about them that he raised the matter with network management. He didn't want Robin to have that impression of him because he was a correspondent at the time. He got ahead of it by approaching and telling them it wasn't real, the insider claimed. Page Six was told by a third source that Holmes called executive producer of Good Morning America Michael Korn to assure him the rumors were absolutely not true. The insider went on to say, it terrified them. The rumors caused the friendship between Amy and TJ to suffer. In December 2022, a source also told Entertainment Tonight that Robach was suffering the consequences of the affair more so than Holmes. Amy has always been a renowned journalist who is competent and professional. She undoubtedly feels it coming at her from all directions. She has worked hard to establish herself as a staple at a BC and enjoys her profession, the insider said. The way TJ lives is a little less serious. 
On December 1, 2022, a different insider informed The Sun that Robach and Holmes would lose their jobs on Good Morning America as a result of their relationship. They cannot possibly continue working at GMA, the insider claimed. They might not be officially dismissed, but they will be demoted, which will make it unattractive for them to stay. According to a copy of the deal obtained by the publication, The Sun also claimed that Robach and Holmes' affair may have violated a morality clause, which mandates that talent act at all times with appropriate regard to public morals and customs. Additionally, it was noted in the provision that talent was not allowed to engage in any actions which seek to bring you or us into public notoriety, contempt, controversy or ridicule dot 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 or which might reflect poorly upon us, or which may harm the success of the programs. The next sentence read, We have the right to end this agreement by giving notice within 30 days after learning of it. On December 1, 2022, a source verified to page 6 that Bob Iger, the CEO of Disney, the owner of ABC, was made aware of Robach and Holmes' relationship on November 28, 2022, one day before it was made public. The insider claimed that ABC News President Kim Godwin has been in frequent communication with Bob Iger since he learned of the incident on Tuesday. They decided to take a watch and wait strategy. The insider stated, Amy and TJ are peers, and it's clear that they get along well on television. Both of them are divorced from their partners. They can choose to live together. Additionally, the source said, in some ways, this is TV gold. Well, let's just hope they stay together. The co-host's relationship was widely known by Good Morning America staff, according to a source who spoke to people at the time. Before their relationship became public, the co-hosts were advised to cut off their flirtatious conduct, the source said. The source claimed that internally, there were so many people who were angry about it. They were sexy, I said. A second insider revealed to people that, in 2021, a year before Robach and Holmes' romance was public, there were whispers of an affair between the two of them. About a year ago, there were whispers that they were having an affair, the person claimed. Many people thought it might have had some truth to it, because it is clear that there is affection between them. But since they always claimed to be happily married, everyone eventually put it down to friendship. How did TJ Holmes' affair with Amy Robach begin? Good Morning America anchors Amy Robach and TJ Holmes reportedly split from their marriages in August 2022 following a month-long affair, according to Page Six's article from November 30, 2022. While Holmes has been wed to attorney Mara Lee Feebig since 2010, Robach has been married to actor Andrew Shu since 2010. Page Six was informed at the time by a source that Robach, and Holmes' relationship began in March 2022 after they started working together to prepare for the New York City Marathon, where they were spotted together on November 6, 2022. Less than three weeks had passed before their liaison came to light. On December 1, 2022, a source told People that Holmes and Robach's romance began when Holmes helped Robach get through a former heartache she was going through. According to the insider, Amy was going through a heartache and TJ was really there for her and supportive, and that is when they started anything. The GMA hosts were reportedly observed canoodling in bars close to ABC News New York City headquarters in May 2022, according to Page Six. They appear to have a very close friendship, but that is to be anticipated. However, they took great care behind the scenes to conceal their relationship. The news that they are having an affair has startled the GMA producers. Page Six at the time was told by a source, according to the Daily Mail, Robach and Holmes' alleged affair first came to light in June 2022, when they were in London together filming the Queen's Diamond Jubilee for a BC and workers were buzzing about the intimacy between them, a source claimed. Everyone is aware that Amy and TJ have been good friends for a considerable amount of time. They even go out running together and socialize with each other's spouses as a foursome. Numerous ABC News employees, including Kim Godwin, the network's president, were said to have been aware of Robach and Holmes' relationship before it became widely known. The source claimed, the worst kept secret at ABC News, they have been dating openly for much longer than a month, and they had no qualms about going out together. The staff is astonished that it took this long to become public because they didn't want the show scandal, everyone was turning a blind eye. Another insider claimed to people that Good Morning America staff members were widely aware of Robach and Holmes' relationship and instructed them to cut off their flirtatious conduct before it became public. The source claimed that internally, there were so many people who were angry about it. They were sexy, I said. There were allegations of an affair between Holmes and Robach in 2021, a year before their relationship was made public. Another source also revealed to people at the time. About a year ago, there were whispers that they were having an affair, the person claimed, because you can see that they have affection for each other. Many people thought that there might be some truth to it, but since they always claimed to be happily married, everyone eventually put it down to friendship. A different source, however, told people at the time that there was no affair between Robach and Holmes and that their romance didn't begin until after they had divorced. This involved two adults who gave their agreement and were divided. 
Within weeks of one another, they both ended their marriages in August, according to the insider. Only after that did the relationship begin. The source went on, she has nothing to conceal. After that, they both felt very at ease dating in public because they were separated. Even their spouses had relocated, so they weren't keeping anything a secret. Around November 2022, Roebuck disabled comments on her Instagram when followers realized she hadn't featured her husband in a while and wasn't wearing her wedding ring. Holmes and Roebuck both deactivated their Instagram accounts later. The Daily Mail published images of the GMA hosts at O'Donoghue's Irish Bar in New York City, close to where Roebuck and Holmes taped Good Morning America, where they were spotted flirting on November 10, 2022, and this led to news of Roebuck and Holmes' relationship breaking on November 30, 2022. The Daily Mail was informed at the time by a source that Roebuck and Holmes visited the couple after taping a daily feature for Good Morning America that was pre-recorded. According to the Daily Mail, Roebuck and Holmes left ABC Studios separately, went on their own to the bar, and then met up in a different area of the restaurant. They were deeply in love with one another. They were both gazing at their phones while she laughed at anything he was saying. They left, and, as he made an Uber call, Roebuck waited on the sidewalk around 20 feet away from Holmes. Roebuck and Holmes entered the Uber together and rode to Holmes' apartment in central Manhattan. Roebuck was not spotted leaving. The following day, Holmes was observed leaving his flat carrying a duffel bag and a bag. Holmes left the restaurant alone and strolled around the corner, checking behind him several times before going up the block. The Daily Mail reported that Roebuck was waiting there to pick him up in her blue BMW convertible.